Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and that sound means just one thing. That's a new Call Me Kevin video. <laughs> Your day has just been cursed. Today we are playing more Family Man. Nothing to do with Family Guy or Matt Groening. My family are pretty pissed off with me and you know what? I kind of get where they're coming from. <laughs> but at the same time, I don't really care. Like, look at the state of what my son made. Do I really want a son who has that little talent? Finally, I can relate to my father. <laughs> okay, they're a little bit hungry, like in general as a household, but other than that, my family are doing fine. I'm going to go out and attempt to do some illegal activities to earn money and buy a gun, hopefully. <laughs> I don't even know what I can do with that gun, but all I know is I really want a gun. But I have to pay them so much, it's hard to feckin' save. Murder Alex Moreland. I'm on the way. Aha, in a perfect dark alley. Oh my god, they're fighting back. Wait, no, I don't like when they fight back. You didn't see nothing. Okay, literally, I don't think they actually saw anything. And by the way, you thought I didn't have my green screen today? No, it was green screened out. That's how ahead of the curve I am. Top notch editing. I'm still trying to figure out the code for this guy's safe as well. He just said something to me as like the secret to car sales is start high and low. So I'm just wondering, I'm going to use the first number out of all of these. So uh, nine, six, five. Three. Nine, six, five, three. Let's try that. I really don't think this will work. Nine, six, five, three. Okay, I'm right. <laughs> what the hell? I really didn't think that would work. Oh, for feck's sake, I'm getting mugged. But you know what? With good luck comes bad. See, this is why I need a gun to protect myself. But to be fair, something like that, like the safe actually working, is so rare for me. That's like a one in 50 chance. Usually I'm always wrong. All right, so now that I've broken into his safe, I've put the mayor on his waiting list for the car. That seems a bit overkill to be honest, I don't know if that was worth the effort. To, but either way, that's sorted. The one problem with this situation about me doing all these odd jobs is uh, my family's about to leave me. Their happiness just ticked down. Okay. All right, they're gone. <laughs> For feck's sake. All right, let's play a board game or something, please. <laughs> Anything to keep you happy. Just not conversation. I can't deal with you guys right now. Okay, that helped with happiness a lot, actually. Oh, what do you want now? Your husband is dead. Get over it. <laughs> I'm losing hope. <laughs> Just like you lost your husband. You know, there was one thing Bobby always said to me. <laughs> he said if I ever wasn't sure how he felt about me, I should find the tallest tree on Ocean View Hill. <laughs> All right, the dead man's giving you riddles. Used to be nothing but the mayor's man is there now. I'm not really expecting much, but could you go check it out? For 30 bucks? Sure. Oh, that was my delivery mission. <laughs> to move it across the road. That is just laziness, paying me to do that. But I've got $862, which... Oh my god. So hold on. No. Oh god, the guy's fast. I don't know why I even need a gun. My guy's so feckin' strong, but oh well. <laughs> Buy a gun. This will make my family happy. <laughs> I don't have enough food for them, and they're getting really pissed off with me, so I bought a gun. Oh, now they need medicine. <laughs> oh, for feck's sake. Wait, where'd it go? I t Where's my gun? I got another murder mission, but I need a feckin' gun. <laughs> I'm sick of beating people to death. God, that's something I never thought I'd say. Oh, wait, do I need pistol ammo? Maybe that's the problem. Because I bought the gun, but I don't have any bullets, I don't think. Oh, fuck's sake. Uh, come with me. Come into this dark alley. God, is he made out of wood? It sounds like you're knocking on a door when you're hitting him in the face. Oh, wait, I just left the gun on the ground. Hands up, everyone. Pew, pew. I don't think my guy's mentally sound enough to be holding this. Thing is, can I not just shoot the mafioso guy now? It really feels like I'd be able to and just murder him and get out of this whole situation. Like, sure, the mafia would probably come and get me, but I might just have to accept that I'm gonna die no matter what I do here. I gotta make them happy. They love it when I clean up the feckin' blood on the ground. And they love when I smush rats with my baseball bat. Come on. I wanna make my family happy. Multi-kill. Fantastic. Do you love daddy again yet? Oh, another Friday, another job. Yes, I'm working for the mafia today, which means I don't have to pay them, which is great. We're going up to the hospital. I really need to make my family like, healthy. <laughs> I need to feed them. But I, I don't know if I can do that today. Do I have to just go on the job? All right, I guess I do. I'm at the hospital. God, I must have sent a lot of people here during this game so far. Talk to the union rep in the ward. Okay, he's blocking bolts or something. I don't know. I wasn't paying that much attention. All I know is kill. No entry. What? You don't work here. You don't know that. I need to borrow some of these clothes. Oh, for feck's sake. I'm just gonna beat you up then. Give me your clothes. <laughs> he's like, I'm kind of busy right now. He's not intimidated at all. You're lucky I don't have Fucking bullets. All right, I guess I'll just beat him up. I like how my logic is you're lucky I don't have bullets and I only have to beat you to death. All right, now I'm disguised. I even have blood all over my hands, so it'll look legit. Hey, I'm that guy from 
two seconds ago. I work here now. God damn it, I can't get into him. There's a cop blocking him. Can I go out the window or something? Is there a balcony? Getting into his room one way or another. Uh, let me in. Jesus Christ, I make a bad doctor. I have no patience. Look at him. He's just staring in at me. He sees I'm in here. Let's talk about the boats. If you want those boats, you're going to have to kill me. What? Maybe you can live with yourself. Okay, this is getting kind of dark. <laughs> oh my God. It's the Drugatron 2500 malfunctioning. It's not my fault. Goodbye. God, this got really dark. That guy just watched the whole thing go down, by the way. All my fingerprints are all over it, by the way. Cut that out. I thought you were already dead. He's talking. All right, well, I'm leaving because that tone is annoying me. It's like one of those things you get to keep away straight cats. Okay, so our boat will be back in action on the dock. You'll find a weapon daily, which is kind of annoying because I just spent all of my money on a weapon. $250 I owe them. Jesus Christ. At least my family's happiness got reset over the weekend. I don't know what I did, but when my guy is isn't being controlled by me. I guess he's just a much better dad. Oh, found this package again. Oh, and I have to deliver it here. God, this courier service is easy. Maybe I should just become a courier in this world. People are very, very lazy. Hey, follow me. I gotta kill you. <laughs> Everyone is so up for a fight in this village. Like, for the amount of bodies that are found in murders, like, they are just ready to fight despite evidence that they really shouldn't. All right, here's the boat. What do we got? Oh, a pistol. Great. I already have one. Feck's sake. Maybe I could give one to my kid or something. Maybe then he'll love me. Reprogram Lucy Lane's Wi-Fi boosters. Okay. The amount of time I get feckin' attacked is unbelievable. <laughs> Thanks for the help, buddy. I really appreciate that. All right. Is this one of the Wi-Fi boosters? Great. Oh, there's a code here. Okay. 2122. No, use your fingers, not your fists for once. Okay, so I rebranded that one to steal your pen. I'm just renaming them all horrible things so that they won't use them. They'll be too afraid. Even though this guy didn't help me at all, what do you want? Sally has a boyfriend. Oh, this is the one you're feckin' stalking, isn't it? We need him out of the picture. <laughs> Why does it always end with killing, no matter who I help? Maybe the boyfriend has an unfortunate accident. He just falls onto my fist. He'll give me 40 bucks for a murder. Okay, you know what? Fine, I'm willing. <laughs> and you really don't have to pay me a lot for me to do really, really horrible shit. Now, I talked to this guy before. He was a really nice man. Die, 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 die. Okay. For once, Victor wasn't the victor. <laughs> Damn it, I should have said that before I punched him the last time. That would have been a cool line to kill him on. Joe, thanks to you, it's finally time to make my move. Okay, happy to ruin a perfectly good relationship. Great. <laughs> I mean, he's never even feckin' talked to her, so I'm not sure this is gonna work. But who am I to get in the way of true love? All right, I got enough money for pistol ammo. There we go. Now I can defend myself. That's totally the only reason I bought it, <laughs> for defense. This town has really gone to crap since I started being a bad person. <laughs> I feel like they should give it the Simpsons move treatment and just drop a giant dome on us. At least then we'd be isolated. Right, what's that other mission I had to do? Uh, collect a body bar from the lake, uh, the wife I boosters, investigate the tallest tree by the mayor's house. Great. I'm so annoyed I bought that gun and then someone just gave me a gun for free on the dock. <laughs> so upsetting. Oh wait, wow. That's what this was all about. It's like, oh, if you ever doubt my love for you, go check the tree. I expected like a time capsule of all their memories together, but no, he just crudely sketched in P plus M. She's gonna be so feckin' disappointed. Now would be a good time to break the news that he's actually dead because I don't think she's gonna care after this big of a letdown. Oh, more treasure. Great. What, what have we got this time? Last time we just got porn or something. I mean, that's what it looked like. It's kind of low res. I don't know. This blocky babes. Come here, you little shit. I need food for my family and I'm unwilling to purchase it. Oh god, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Oh my god, that sound was awful. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> Should have docked. Wait, did I? Oh, I paid today. Oh, thank, thank god. I thought I missed my payment there for a second. It's about to get murdered. Hmm. Please let me win. No, I win. Me win. You never let me win. You made me sad. Look, just get used to it. Trust me, kid. I know you well by now. And at this point, you gotta learn you're gonna be losing a lot in life. To be fair, that kid must boast about his dad a lot. It's like, what does your dad do for a living? Oh, he does a lot of odd jobs around town, but he provides for us mainly by beating the shit out of wild animals and then putting them in the fridge. He's just a man's man, you know? He could probably beat up your dad. <laughs> Oh, Jesus, I own 290 and I- 65 bucks. I spent it all on that stupid gun. At least it'll probably impress my kid anyway. Hey, kid, want to see my new pistol? <laughs> Why won't it shoot? How do I shoot? <laughs> hey, Patch, you want me to take out the other eye? I could even them out for you. Just out of curiosity, like, I know this isn't going to go my way, but what if I killed this dude? <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ, that actually scared me. It was really sudden. I was trying to figure out how to shoot. But he is a quick draw. Jesus. Did not expect him to have that big iron 
wearing on his hip. <laughs> Look at them pretending that they're sad that I'm dead. <laughs> like 10 minutes ago, I was threatening it with a gun in the living room. They're so happy. All right, I better get some odd jobs done and fast. <laughs> I wonder if like gun violence in public is cool in this town because they don't seem to mind when I beat the shit out of people. <laughs> We good? We cool, everyone? Yeah? All good? <laughs> there is a uh, flashing police badge coming up, but other than that, I think I'm fine. He does not care about the people. Are you talking about me? Oh, here's the guy I need help with. Oh, really? Dude, I have a gun out. The saying is literally, don't bring a knife to a gunfight. <laughs> You want some? Come and get it. I don't know how to put the gun away. <laughs> All right, what do you want? Joe, it's time. What are we doing now? Meet me at Lover's Point. Wait, is he actually in love with me after all this time? <laughs> He's a feckin' lunatic. I don't know where Lover's Point is, but I'm about to see a murder, I think. And for once, it's not gonna be me doing it. Oh, I think I see him up there, actually. Oh, keen eyesight from the old laser vision that I installed a few years back. Oh, Jesus! Ah, ah hunting! <laughs> that gun was a mistake. <laughs> like, this village was so peaceful. Two, two weeks ago. And now I've like replaced a nice seaside house with this horrible plant. There's daily gun shipments. There's gun crime graffiti everywhere. I put a giant feck sign over the entire village. All right, here I am. Lover's point. Where is Sally? I'm worried already. Where's the body? I'll reopen the bank in Riverport. You can make a free withdrawal every day. Oh my God, it pays to be evil. You again. You need to just leave me alone. God, he is a stalker. This is meant to be. I can't be without you. We should be together. <laughs> I don't like you. <laughs> I don't even know you. And far as I can tell, you're someone who thinks that money can replace a personality. Just hear me out. You'd have a great life with me <laughs> on my arm at parties. You'd never go without. Uh, she has no interest, dude. We, we should probably kill her. Joe, I need to deal with this. <laughs> what? <laughs> Stop him. No, let him go. Oh my god, he's got a gun. <laughs> he's blaming her. If I can't have you, nobody can. Don't do this. Wait, I'll join you. Oh, come on, dude. You took the fun part. Mm. Well, Joe, guess it wasn't meant to be. <laughs> See you back at the bank. You're about to make some money. Great. That's great news. Oh my god, poor Sally. I mix in with some shady people. Probably because I do whatever the hell people want me to do just for money. So, I don't know. I, I get mixed in with a shady crowd. Right, where is the bank? Is this the bank? Oh wait, ATM maybe? I don't understand. He was supposed to open the bank. <laughs> and to make matters worse, the bank is insulting me too. Oh, I found the last Wi-Fi booster. One, two, two, one. There we go. Oh, at least that's done. Uh, maybe I'll come back tomorrow. Maybe the bank will be open then. We should also go check our daily weapon shipment. God, there's so much going on in this game now. This game is so much more to it than I thought. Okay, so I guess I used all the pistol bullets, so I have to get a new pistol. Well, then it all worked out in the end. Want a selfie of me with my gun? <laughs> we should do a collab soon. Looks just like my business email. Oh, there's the person I killed earlier. No one will suspect the only guy in town who has a gun. <laughs> have you seen Bobby? Dude, he's dead. Just get over it. You're such a good friend. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Why does no one think I'm a bad dude? Everyone loves me. They're all just like, well, there goes the protagonist. What a nice guy, I would assume. <laughs> oh, new clue for new Treasure, the fallen tree where the land meets the sea. Shouldn't that be by the beach then, I guess? Okay, it's dark and I can't find this treasure. Why do they have to be so hard? Why can't it be like under the feck? <laughs> that would be a lot more straightforward. Another day, another murder. <laughs> Honestly, it's the only way I've been managing to pay off the mafia is by murdering people. <laughs> Wait, what the hell? Okay, that did absolutely nothing to him. There we go, a nice slow motion uppercut. The politician in the background saying I will stand for the people as I beat the shit out of one of his people. Oh look, this is the guy I helped earlier by ruining his business by making the feck sign instead of the bird sign. Looks like he's down in his luck. Nothing to do with me though. <laughs> he's kinda pissed at me though. I spent every last penny on that sign and you got it wrong. <laughs> we can't all be winners, Bert. <laughs> End of the line, mission complete. That's what I like to see. I'm noticing I'm getting achievements here. Like, I got pride for that and lust for the last one. Are we getting all the deadly sins here? Can I be the glutton, please? I really want a pizza. Oh, wait, is this place cleared now? I don't know how to pick blueberries. <laughs> so I'm doing what I always do, resorting to violence. Is that a feckin' wolf? All right, I feel a little bit safer now. <laughs> I gotta do that mission, though. Find the body part out by the lake. What the hell is this? Is this kind of some stonecutter secret society shit? How do I get in there? Okay, this... This game has so much to it. <laughs> no, feck off. Like, it could just be a dog for all I know. Okay, it was a wolf. <laughs> Probably for the best. <laughs> oh my god, what the hell is that? <laughs> the hell? 
What was that? B a bear? I didn't realize that it, it got so wild up here. There should probably be at least a sign or something warning them. Even though, to be honest, no matter how dangerous it gets up there, it's still safer than the town. I have feckin' ruined that place. I have to deliver the small box of not drugs. <laughs> okay, phew. I thought I was delivering something illegal, but unlikely by the look of that box. Boxes can't lie. Oh, wait. I've gone out to the lake. Oh, great. Now I need to look for that body part. <laughs> All right, body part's over there. What do you want? Mm. We're here for wolves. The teeth. Oh, I have some already. <laughs> what a coincidence. This gives me so confused. He always asks me for these random animal parts, and I'm like, oh, I have some right here. I'll oh, back off, punk. <laughs> At least I can say I have this gun for hunting. I have been killing a lot of animals with it. Speaking of which, there we go. <laughs> At least it's just an insta-kill on them. This cop was setting me up. Oh my god, this game is way darker than it appears on the surface. I found the body that the cannibal ate. Now, I think we should uh, bring this leg to the police chief and uh, maybe head home for the day. <laughs> God, that water is a lot more um, solid sounding than you would expect from water. This map is way bigger than I thought it would be too. Like I've not been up there and I've not been in that diner yet at all, but I really got to get home. I got this leg on me, a gun that's been freshly fired. Like I look extremely suspicious right now. God, I've set this place up to be a tourist destination with that feck sign though. So many people will come from across the land to get their picture by the feck sign. My family are getting really pissed off. I've just realized. Oh my God, what the hell? Mm. Oh my God, what is this cop up? to. You were supposed to leave it in the trunk. Oh my god, he's the cannibal. Just ignore this. It's official police business you wouldn't understand. You're cooking a foot. Sheriff, are you the cannibal killer? <laughs> listen, Joe, listen, you're my deputy. You keep this between us. I'll allow you certain police powers in town. Okay. <laughs> god, I love what you've done with the place, uh, officer. I'm, I'm gonna leave now. <laughs> the thing is, he was saying that, like, I'll leave you off with small things, just don't get crazy. I've gotten crazy way before now. Oh, I got the achievement gluttony. Fantastic. It's three down, four to go, I think. Okay, I need food for my family quite bad. They need to be cared for. Can you give me something that'll help them? Inventory full. Shit, shit, shit. I, I really gotta go feed them. All right, I'm coming, family. I've got a carrot and a drumstick. God, they always are on the verge of starving. I'm just not a good dad. All right, beat some rats. Beat some rats. That'll make them love me. Come here, you little shit. I think I'm just ruling out a fear. I don't think it'll make them love me. I think it'll make them fear me. Like, I have loads of meat. They can be well fed with that. It just makes them really unhappy. <laughs> I think they're all vegetarians, and I've just been force-feeding them this meat. Mmm. I wish they would stop sneaking up on me and going, Mmm, every time I turn around. <laughs> All right, and with that ominous sound, it, we've come full circle. We started with it, and now we're gonna end with it. I hope you enjoyed the video. I've been really enjoying this game. There's so much to it, and I think it's quite special because I don't think a lot of people have played this game on YouTube, so it's kind of our own thing, and I don't know where it's going, so I'm assuming you don't know where it's going either, but uh, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed. I appreciate you watching, as always. Um, if you want to see more of my stuff, I post every day, but I also stream on Twitch, and the link for that is in the description. Uh, but other than that, I'll just thank you again for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now. Shout out to Patreons Ducksters, Donald, Eccentric, Elliot Bartel, Alyssa Lozano, Emma Crawford, Epic Mousy, Eric Schweiner, Esther Sokolova, Ethan Besant, Evan Webb, Aya Flat Yucatul, FD Lump, Felicia Rhodes, Fluffy Laser Wolf, Friendo Kirsten, Gabriel Morell, Galen Hayes, General Havoc, Gingy Ginge, Glenn and Becky, God Emperor, Growl Plank, Kartiko, Havco, Heinrich420, Howie Thief, Infinity Void Gaming, Isaac Coey, and Jerry Van Dorsessler.